look at this. I just think this is just such a beautiful setup of uh, flowers. And I'm sure now we're at the end of the summer, so probably uh, probably chances are, you know, it's even just uh, beginning to turn itself down a little bit. But really beautiful. So I'm yeah, here well. with the gorgeous young. <laughs> I would say that now. I, I would say, say I will say now. Great, great little garden here. When you when a lot of people travel here along Black Line, of course, and the, the, I'm sure it's a lovely little. Um, Kind of boost for them as they walk by and see all the colours. Yeah, we do. we love the, our old flowers. Was this uh, was this always the way? Like from the first, I don't know how long you've been here. Were you always? I've been here all my life. Ah, all my life. brilliant. I mean, I moved out for maybe three years or so, and that was it. I was back then. It was my mother and father lived ah. here, and, and we had a flower bed along there, but that was all taken out. But now, so I use my hanging baskets. Instead, nice. Because I like my flowers along the. And bed, the love, the love of flowers would that have come from mom or dad or dad. both? Dad, dad, ah. dad loved his flowers. Right, loved right. His flowers. He'd nearly cry when he'd see his flowers dying. At the end of the <laughs> he loved his flowers. I'm getting a bit like that myself. Yeah. <laughs> my granddaughter yeah. comes yeah. in the other day and she takes a big walk at the pink one down oh, there. Oh, holy moly! And I'm, well, she's oh, off. The, she's off the Christmas list. She's off that. the Christmas list. She, she, she can learn. We have a few more around the back. Yeah, we'll have a look there now as well. That'd be nice. So now. It's, it looks like a full-time kind of job. Obviously, when you once you get the plate spinning, it, it sort of looks after itself to a point. But you've you've well, got a lovely a um, lot of deadheading and a lot of right. Um, I was going to say that there seems to be a lot of good um, a lot of good work here because you're you're kind of keeping everything fairly tidy, especially with the baskets. Oh, the baskets you've got to keep an eye on the guys and yeah, yeah. Ah, oh, look at this. Oh, this is great. Ah, look at this little heaven. The dogs are going to start barking. Ah, of course, of course. Well, that's their job now, just to make sure strangers like me aren't sniffing around now. This is a great little heaven. I tell you, you get a nice little sun trap now. here. Hi guys, he's all right. He's all right. Oh, good. Good dog. Good dog. It's nearly gone now. This is, I'm afraid. Of course. Yeah. Well, uh, we're, we're going to start doing this every year, and we'll, we'll obviously start doing it a little bit earlier in the year next year. We just uh, kind of came up with the idea and said, you know what? Before the summer's out, we should start. Uh, Kind of making a record of all the yeah, lovely all the gardens because there's yeah. loads of great. Uh, oh, there's some beautiful gardens. Because we do, uh, of course, we do live in the garden uh, county, so we do, don't inevitably. We definitely do. And, uh, and there goes the cat. Ah, uh, yeah. I think Max is uh, he's a bit slow when it when it comes. He never, he likes to chase, but he never actually uh, catches them. Thankfully, he just. Uh, the sunflowers, I think, have had it. I don't think there. There's a few here. All right. But I don't think they're going to get enough sun now. Ah. Uh, and this would be the sun trap, I'd say. I'd say you've got oh, a lovely. It's uh, absolutely beautiful. That's it, you know, when you get this your is little. My big little one that my granddaughter is killed watching. Nice. <laughs> so, would you now have sort of automatically sort of taken over the garden early on, or was it just a gradual thing that you sort of helped, and then before you know it, you're the oh, one no, who's out I would here? I gradually taken it over. I you're remember right. when yeah. my father died, Lord of Mercy, and I went out and I said, Oh, please God, if you're up there, Daddy, which is the weed and which is the flower? <laughs> <laughs> hadn't a clue, hadn't a clue, not a clue. Yeah, it Just always... remember him loving the garden, but I hadn't a clue. Well, you certainly have it's a clue now. Was it? Was it? Was it? I don't know whether you felt um, it was. It took you a while, or whether you just fell into it pretty quickly. Because no, it took me a while to get you know th colors and that together. But yeah. I, mean, I fell into it then, and I loved it. I just love, and I love this little area for myself. Ah, yeah. Well, I think you that's. Know, a, I think that's it. the ideal for everybody <laughs> in this world. If you can have your, you know, your house and you're comfortable in your warm bed and all that, but somewhere to just almost step out of everything. Yeah, exactly. And yeah, just be exactly. sort of a, this. This would be you know anywhere in the world. You're just going to be surrounded by plants and flowers. You've just sort of, uh, in your own way, you've sort of gone back to nature. Yeah, you know, which is great. That's my jasmine over there, and it used to grow in a hay, on a shed. Oh right, right. It had right. a little stalk down there where it came from originally. Okay. And a friend of mine cut it back for me one winter, uh -huh. and I said, uh, "That's grand, like uh, just nice now. It's nice and back." And the next yeah. thing, did me snip down the bottom of it and killed it. Ah. Uh, and I just stood. Another quite. person off your get off your Christmas list. But what are these people thinking? The dead roots all. Back to life on the wow. and start again. They are it's a resilient thing, you know, they'll yeah. find a way. You know, they'll always um they'll always stretch even if there's a gap between them and, and the and the soil or whatever. They they just seem to sort of find oh, yeah. some way of getting through, especially in, in the good old Irish weather where where you're constantly <laughs> being watered and given a bit of sun and a bit of sun and a bit of rain and a bit of whatever's going. Well I gotta say it's beautiful and the next time you're having a garden party now I'll put it up on, on the guide. You. Yeah, I'll You'll put it well I'll put it up on the guide now. We we'll get everybody up You'll there, yeah, yeah. <laughs>